Hey, what's going on guys? It's Jamil with Mill Mid Studios. I have an unboxing, if I can say that, video of an Alpha Guard skin for my uh, Lumix S1R. Here it is. Um, I'm a huge proponent of you know customizing your gear, adding some artistic flair to uh, you know your belongings. So obviously, when I saw these guys on Instagram, um, Alpha Guard, um, I decided to make a purchase and put one on and see what it looks like. So I just want to do a quick unboxing with you guys. I won't do like a tutorial on how to put it on, only because I'm definitely not an expert. So I'm going to fight with it and then I'll show you what the finished product looked like and kind of my struggles along the way because I do foresee I'll probably have some. Uh, we got the Panasonic Lumix S24-105 mm f4 macro OIS lens skin and then the Panasonic S1 and S1R mirrorless digital camera skin and I got custom colors. Um, the color that I got you'll see when I open it here uh, well actually it's military green so I'm very excited to see what this looks like. Uh, I guess in, inside also comes an application toolkit. So let's see what we got here. Okay. Okay. Here we go. This is going to be a very intense process. I can feel it. So packaging is fine. Packaging is a little beaten up, but everything in here looks good. So Panasonic Lumix S24 to 105. So this is for the lens right here. Then we have the this is for the body, the Lumix S1 S1R. So this is a color it's going to be. It's a little darker. It looks a little darker than I thought it would be, but still that's going to look amazing. And then you have the lifeguard toolkit. I'll open that up so you can see what it kind of looks like. Okay, so these kind of tweezer looking things over here, and then this, and I'm guessing that's to kind of compress uh, the wrap once you put it on there so you get a good contact with the camera itself. So I'm going to put this on, <laughs> I don't know how long it's going to take me, but um, I'll put it on and you guys can see exactly what it looks like and I'll tell you kind of how my experience was, and you guys let me know what you think in the comments. Alright guys, here we are. Um, super happy with the way this thing turned out. Like, just super happy. I will say this, if you're going to do this, make sure you set aside like an hour and a half to have this done and to have it done properly. Um, let me see if I could focus here, maybe. Okay, so you see how the... Uh, there we go. You see how like the Lumix lettering is there and then the numbers are here. All of that, it's the original lettering, so you have to make sure that when you... Um, uh, put the wrap on it's lined up perfectly with it because that's not lettering that comes with the packaging um, or with the wrap that's the actual original lettering so you have to make sure that that stuff's like really well lined up and that will kind of set you up for success for the rest of the the body and the lens um, another thing um, just on the top here let's see if we'll focus we're using a g9 right now guys so you know how that is okay so you see that right there um, that's because I didn't stretch the uh the the material they don't recommend you stretch it but they say that if you are like a little bit short you can pull you can stretch it a little bit i didn't do it there um and that's fine i kind of applied that new skill of stretching if i needed a bit more material to the rest of the body which came out very nice like it's it's really impressive the fit and finish it really transforms the camera i really can't even explain um how much I love this. It was a great um, investment for me so far. We'll have to see how it holds up. Another thing is um, definitely use the tools. Oh yes, and if you're going to do this, make sure you either have a blow dryer or a heat gun. I used a heat gun. Um, at the end of wrapping everything, I kind of went over it with a heat gun and really kind of just pressed down gently um, all over the body to make sure things are really nice and really... Um, uh, secure price of the lens and the price of the body wrap they're separate so i think it came up to for me like just a little bit over um maybe even a little under 100 bucks i forget i gotta look at the receipt anyways guys this is just kind of um a quick video showing you kind of what's in the package 
um, and then what the finished product could potentially look like depending on what color you get. I love the military green, the red accents. I just think it looks awesome. So let me let me know if you guys like that, um, how it looks, and maybe if you're considering on getting one for your camera. Check out the website. I'll put it down in the description. Um, yeah, it came quick. I have no complaints whatsoever. Anyways, guys, we'll see you in the next one. Take care.